Now to our ongoing investigation into San Francisco's Millennium Tower. Even as they attempted to fix the sinking and leading tower, the problem is getting worse. Tonight, our investigative reporter Jackson Vanderpecken explains experts now believe the building is doing the opposite of what they predicted it would do when they started this fix. Here we are outside the limits in an alarming fashion. Engineer Rune Storson studies what causes failures of man-made structures at UC Berkeley's Center for Catastrophic Risk Management. For years, he's been monitoring what's been happening at the sinking tower, which is now tilting 22 inches. The engineers now working to fix the building recently told city officials how much more settlement could be expected, about an inch per year. But data shows the tower sinking an inch in just three months. The curve is headed steeply to the level that engineers say marks the limit for settlement, five and a quarter inches. That's a big red flag. It's tilting and leaning way more than what they predicted. In fact, the design team provided an analysis of expected settlement when they submitted their plan to the city. It shows settlement, not on the outside, but at the core, marked in magenta with yellow areas on the outside expected only to settle a little or not at all. But in fact, that's where the building is now sinking the most. Clearly, there's a, a skew or a deviation between what you thought was going to happen and what's actually happening out there. So this is a, it's, it's a non-routine, non-standard project. Um, it's in a heavily congested city environment. And so the consequences, if you don't get it right, are pretty severe. Storson says it's time to look beyond the oversight of the city's appointed design review panel, the same panel that approved the now troubled fix in the first place, to bring in outside scientists with no prior involvement. The fact that we're seeing time and time again performance that's outside the bounds of, of what you expected, again, I, I think it's time for a fresh look, fresh set of eyes, um, and kind of relying on uh, the same team to provide that fresh perspective I think would be challenging. So far, the building department's appointed design review panel has expressed full confidence in the fixed team's capabilities. The city says it's awaiting more data to determine what to do next. Jackson Vanderbecken, NBC, Bay Area News.